Hi everybody, this is Nerdcore Limit, and we're gonna talk about... Well, are you guys like movies about medieval times? Well, you don't need to see that all the time in the movies. There's actually an organization called International Medieval Combat Federation. It's a fully contact sport fighting in which combats are used in historical accurate reproduction of medieval armor and blunt weapons to engage in competitive fights according to authentic historical tournament rules. Founded in 2013, the organization now attracts hundreds of fighters from 26 countries. Fighting is exclusively on foot and strict rules and enforced to ensure the safety of the competitors. Most teams are 5-on-5, five five, individual duels and even 15-of-15 15 15 teams events. Rules for the competition closely on the original medieval test, outlining sport for non-lethal tournaments. Rules are regularly updated and responds to observations during the competitions. Some rules of fighting may vary somewhat year by year. The armor, all fighters must be wear historical steel and enclose the torso, limbs, head, hands, and neck, and beneath this a paddle layer. All armor must be style traceable to historical period and location. No piece may date for more than 50 years of another. Fighters may wear a supplementary third layer of protective equipment beneath. Get ready. All weapons are reproduction based on historical originals. All weapons must be blunt and with the set of weight and size category. Depend upon the weapon. Metal, maces, axes, sword and pole arms are all permitted in group fights, but no stabbing. Well, Warhammers and weapons with hammer attachments may not be used in international events, since can be too dangerous in attacks. Shields are regulated as weapons, while being historical in design, shields must be meet a minimal weight requirement and not have a narrow or sharp or metal edges. Now the other interesting part, there's another organization called N1 Global. M1 Global or MMAA is a mixed martial art promotional base in St. Petersburg, Russia, which organized between 10 to 20 competitions per year. On July 18 of 2018, it was announced that M1 has agreed in partnership with the Ultimate Fighter Championship or UFC. The M1 has something called Selection. It's a MMA competition where the next generation of fighters are given the opportunity to showcase their skills on the world stage with fighters being eliminated after only one loss. Victory will advance the winning fighters through a tournament and earn their trip to the championship event where they compete for the M1 Selection title kind of interesting about that at MMA medieval style. But oh well, this is Nerdcrawl Unlimited and we see you soon for more news.